Welcome guys in our Azure SQL Server tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to focus on how to connect your Azure SQL database to your Excel. So, how can we do that? First of all, we are on our main dashboard. There is a database as demo SQL. Okay, so guys, first of all, before access your Azure database, you need a IP configuration on the Azure server, and that IP IP should be from your machine. So here you can set your IP address. Okay, you just pass the rule name and your IP address, start and end. Then after that, uh, you have to need a connection history here there are different type of connection history edu.net to connect your applications .net applications jdbc to connect your applic uh, other software like power bi excel postgre uh, sql server and talent then odbc to connect with oracle then php to connect your php applications okay then uh, here this is the connection string i have just copied this connection string and paste it into my note notepad then i am going to open my excel file here you can see in the data there is a option from other sources click on it and you can choose from sql server okay then you have to pass your ho server here so just copy this okay and go to the your excel paste it control v then the user id and their password then i am going to use my user id sql admin in the SGO server at the rate SGO server okay then pass the my password then click on next button let's see what happened okay so there is some invalid connection so what i need to do i need to remove this this is my server and click on next button okay now it is connected you can see over there is a database master then demo sql i have selected my demo sql and there is a table like department amp sales so i am click on tb sales and click on next button okay now save pa password in line in file so there is no need so i am just going to okay so search keyword there is no need authentication settings okay so this is the table and if you want to describe it you can do that so guys you can see it is very easy to connect uh, your excel to your azure sql database then finish it okay now i am just going to choose table okay it is asking the password so you can pass the password over here again click on ok button and you can see there is the data which is coming from my table okay you can set it as you want so first of all i need to remove this delete so this is the data which is coming from my azure sql database so guys you can see it is very easy to connect uh, your excel to your azure sql database you need an authorized ip address then your connection string with user credentials so guys please subscribe my youtube channel to learn more on azure 